morning, good morning. Welcome to another vlog. I have a couple of updates to tell you. So number one is um, I'm so happy, so happy that my sinus has cleared up. It took me five days, five days for my sinus to clear up, but I am back to normal. I'm on my feet with the energy, with the mood, and I'm very, very happy. And I hope that she doesn't come back anytime soon. We are on the road. We are actually heading over to the house. I can't wait for you guys to see the house. The house now looks more happy. Uh, before that house was dark and gloomy. It was just sad and it just needed a little bit of love and attention. So what a bucket of paint and some lighting can do to a home. Unbelievable. So I can't wait to show you guys. Another update is that I got my Helix re-pierced. I had both of my Helix pierced at one point in my life unfortunately it didn't heal really well so i had to like close them up and then they would get like bumps on the back of my ears which i have no idea i, I think it's very common the piercing place that i go to they had a sale going on they had a 20 dollar anywhere piercing 20 dollars. so i said you know what this is the perfect time let's reattempt that again it is very affordable and if it doesn't heal well or something happens then at least i'm not losing a lot of money it's just 20 dollars. so we redid it again and for some reason i think that this time is going to heal really really nicely so when i was there and she was actually done with the piercing i asked if she may give me a tissue because um i know that on that area it bleeds a little bit as i was heading out i asked her if i can actually go ahead and get a tissue and she did give me a tissue and as she was giving me the tissue i smelled witch hazel so i asked her do i smell witch hazel and she's like yes that is witch hazel and she's like witch hazel is really good for inflammation i'm like oh my gosh i didn't know that so she said that i can actually go ahead and apply three times witch hazel and the saline spray that i actually get in that place so i do the saline spray three times a day and then the witch hazel three times a day and this is actually my third day since i got my piercing and it's like it's not even there like i don't feel it and this is why i feel like this time might just work if i continue to do what i'm doing i tried to put my hair on a bun away from my face so that area is free from the hair because sometimes the hair gets tangled up and i don't really want that i want this to really really heal i found this recipe and it is super easy i've been on the chickpeas era non-stop so now that we are actually heading over to the property i made sure i had my chickpeas for snack because i don't really know how long we're gonna be here so if i do get hungry i just want to make sure that i do have something to eat so this morning i wake up and as i'm cleaning around the house getting everything tidy up i made sure i also made my chickpeas and these are so crunchy and these are so good and these are so so easy you go ahead and you rinse them and then you dry them up very very gently because they're very uh gentle and they break easily so and then you pour olive oil you pour garlic salt onion powder cayenne pepper paprika garlic powder pepper and i think that's pretty much it so once i have all of those seasonings in with the olive oil i do a good shake but i shake the the bowl like if i was a uh, chloe kardashian shaking her salad how much you guys love it eating a salad with us and just shaking a salad I think I've made a phenomenon about shaking salads. Shake a salad. That's literally how I shake it because they're so gentle and fragile that they break easily. So that technique of Khloe Kardashian salad shaker method works perfectly for my chickpeas. And then I put it in the air fryer for 400 degrees for 20 minutes. Make sure that they are nice and flat and there's like a no overlay on top of the, the other one and they are done. They come out like this and they are so crunchy. They are so good and they are delicious.
paint and lighting changes the whole aesthetic of a house. This house, you guys saw, this house was so dark, especially up here on the second floor. This, this second floor had very little lighting. There was only this right here, this light right here, and that was it, covering the whole entire hallway. The loft area didn't have no lighting. This bedroom, the first bedroom, didn't have no lighting. And now they both have ceiling fans, they have lightings. This whole entire hallway has three Reese's lights. And then the loft, perfect, the four Reese's light. I just, I'm so, so excited. It just looks so beautiful. The carpet blends so well. The black trims just give it that nice touch. So everything is coming together and I'm so happy. So the bathrooms, they are gonna be working on it this week, especially this uh, upper bathroom here. The guy will be working on it this week. And then also the floorings downstairs will be taking care of also this week. This carpet actually was done yesterday. A whole entire day and he did a phenomenal job he always does a good job i love how everything just blends in together so i'm not gonna show you the chandelier from the foyer because it's not at its highest peak just yet i want everything be done and then i will definitely go ahead and show you the chandelier but i'm not gonna show you that just yet because i want you guys to see the whole entire house finish but and yeah that's pretty much it. I hope that you guys like this video. So I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here. Um, it's been a chatty one, but I just wanted to go ahead and give you guys an update of the house. Next time you guys see the house, there'll be more improvement of the house. And every time you guys see the house updates, we are one step ahead of leaving this beautiful home. This is all it needed. Some TLC, some lighting. This house was beautiful, how it was, and now it is stunning so um that's that i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go thank you so much for sticking around thank you so much for watching the entire vlog i appreciate you and thank you so much and i will talk to you guys on my next one bye the next day